All right, what else do we have in here? Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Oh, God. Lot of developer screens for this. Oh. No kind of intro story, just yeah. <laughs> and credits in the option. Lovely. And we're starting in the future. Oh my. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. Lordy lord, this is something else. Okay. So, do we... that button means, but then, uh, I guess that sound means. And I had nine grenades either way, but, uh... <laughs> yeah, nine grenades either way. CPU. I don't know what I can do with a CPU, but I sure do have one. Also, from certain angles, it looks like Arnold's wearing a um, engineering suit from uh, Star Trek uh, Next Generation and on. The uh, gold colors on top. have the next key card yet. Great that the thermal vision comes with an amazingly annoying sound. It's exactly what we want as gamers. Okay. Don't get up there either. Curious. There was another pathway we could have taken. Well, at least that is actually recognizable as actually both of these, uh, bo both of those, the uh, flying one and the tank one. Those are actually recognizable as things from the movie. So, congrats, game! You you actually get a point for representing something from the movie in your game. You then lose three points because those were the first class of things and were not really used, you know, at the point where off in the future all the stuff was happening. They had been upgraded and replaced by this point. Okay, so 
get to that after we destroy the generator. I suppose we can finish a single level of this, it shouldn't be too hard. Alright, so you hold R, hit left and right, and then up and down to change stuff. Okay, so we get, um, more and more damage. Well, the more damage we take. <laughs> and the eye uh, drops are random! Fantastic! Well, I guess green means super difficult in the future. Numbers that are appearing. I don't know if that's just showing the damage I'm doing or points I'm getting. I am now noticing actually. You have a uh, number down there, 590. Yeah, that's that is definitely the points I'm getting. Okay. <laughs> Just we get all of our skin back. <laughs> Hi. So, um, yeah. I'm actually gonna stop here, but I gotta say, this is not terrible. This is way better than I was expecting. This is actually playable. I mean, it's not amazing or anything, but for a movie tie-in game, especially a movie tie-in game of Terminator 3, which is still kind of the black sheep of the Terminator family. Although it's, it has competition, that is for certain. Uh, yeah, I would say almost recommended if you are really curious. It's, um... <laughs> you, you could certainly do better than this, but you, compared to a lot of the other Terminator games, it's actually not that bad. 
So, um, yeah, this has been Terminator 3 Rise of the Machines, and I think we're about done here.